What's going on, guys? So, uh, let's do knife edges. I'll try to make this video really quick. There is a, a trick to uh, flying a knife edge uh, and uh, turning while knife edging. And that is, notice the wings. This will be a perfect 90 degrees. Come a little bit closer. And while you're turning, you can lean the wings just a little bit. See that? And at this point, just like that, there's no rudder needed. Right here. Very little, like 5% maybe. There's no rudder needed. Same thing to the other side. It basically flies on a wing. Oh, there you go. Now I'll slow down the physics uh, to about 70%. But you can see you know, that would be perfect 90, right? Come on. That'd be perfect 90, but before you turn, lean the wings. And sometimes you would have to give the opposite rudder to force it towards the ground because the plane otherwise wants to fly out. So if you would have too much of an angle, the plane just goes straight out. There's a little trick, just a little. But uh, I guess you can call it a cheat. And once you get comfortable, you're just going to start flying at 90 degrees. But even then, you can see there's still a little bit of an angle. Bank the other way. That wasn't cool. No angle here, but if I do give it a little bit, I don't need rudder at all. It just keeps flying. So there it is, one and a half, I don't know the proper terms, so there you go. Flying a knife edge, you're already uh, giving it some rudder, so you give it right aileron, there you go, and the opposite. That's a cool snap, pretty safe to perform to, of course, uh, stay in the altitude you're comfortable at. And let's do it again. Knife fetch. And the more, uh, I guess, the more elevator and rudder you give it, uh, the more wobble you're going to get out of it, and it's going to look uh, cooler, I guess. Let's try it. Oh, overdid it. Let's do it on the other side. Uh, let's give it more. Ooh. Uh, let's do it from left to right. That was good. Do it again. That was pretty cool. There you go. And it doesn't have to be blistering fast. Uh, actually, it looks cooler when it's uh, a little slower. Oh, there you go. Very cool looking. <laughs> and a knife edge turn. There you go. Hmm, my computer is running low. Either way, um, that's a cool move.
it needs to have uh, some wobble to it. I mean, uh, otherwise it doesn't look like a snap. Otherwise it'd be just a rolling, just aileron roll. But there's guys that do use uh, elevator. There's some that don't. And I guess you can tell the difference. I'm not sure, but uh, you know, it really doesn't really matter. Uh, to me, it really doesn't. As long as you're having fun, it doesn't have to be uh, perfect. I guess unless you go to competitions. There you go. Man, I can't stop it. Uh... Yeah, snaps are becoming really, really popular, so. But why not? So that was 360 times 2. Well, I guess that's it. So, um, uh, to recap, I guess uh, there is a little trick flying knife edges, uh, basically, fly them on the wings, kind of like that, with the wings just uh, having a little bit of uh, angle to it, and you're basically flying on the wing just like, just like doing a, a funnel hover. No, that's not a funnel hover, that would be uh, Daniel Holman's maneuver. I forgot what it's called now. Uh, but practice that and then uh, having too much fun and then I guess uh, wonder what else uh, what kind of video to do of what maneuver something basic would be cool right uh, something um, a total uh, beginner that just starting out uh, can do, which I guess, uh, man, I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it up to you guys. Uh, comment on what uh, you think should be uh, like a really, really beginner maneuver. Something where you just uh, you're flying for a while and you just got you just decided, hey, I'm not gonna fly in circles and it's time to do some 3D maneuvers. So let me know, let's crash it, there you go. And so again, there is a trick to uh, knife edge uh, uh, turns or knife edges or high speed knife edges. Uh, and then the snaps, uh, again, uh, it's a, just about full, ail full aileron and uh, a little bit of rudder and a little bit of aileron. I'm sorry, elevator, a little bit of elevator. Some don't use elevator at all. Not gonna name anybody, but uh, uh, just a rudder and aileron, and it's just uh, as good. I mean, uh, if you're having fun, I guess uh, that's what matters the most. So keep it fun. See ya.